Florida teenager's home this morning after running away with a high school soccer coach for nearly a week. 17-year-old Caitlin Frazina was reunited with her mom and dad over the weekend in Syracuse, New York. The 27-year-old 20, Ryan Rodriguez is now under arrest. Meg Oliver spoke with Frazina's parents after the reunion in an interview you'll see only on CBS This Morning. Meg, we are also glad that she is home safe. Absolutely. Good morning to all of you. These last few days have been an emotional roller coaster for the Frazina family. They say they're happy to have their daughter back and safe in their arms, and that Rodriguez will face consequences for taking their child away. When you saw her for the first time, what was that like for you, Ward? Uh, like the weight of the world being off my shoulders, I think. Mm. Ward Frasina initially blamed himself for his daughter's disappearance. He encouraged 27-year-old Ryan Rodriguez to apply for the high school coaching job that brought him into their lives. Ward, how are you holding up? It's been difficult. I'm glad to have my daughter back where I know I can protect her and keep her safe, as a father always wants to do. Ward and Scarlett Frasina traveled more than a thousand miles to reunite with their daughter in New York. How long did you hug her? I don't know. <laughs> Till we had to breathe, I think. Oh. When you go that long without seeing or talking to her, you don't want to let her go. Police say a New York State trooper noticed Rodriguez's car with a Florida tag. The officer pulled him over in a shopping mall parking lot and arrested him without incident. Frasina was in the passenger seat. Did she tell you why? She left? We haven't gotten into all of that yet, and um, we will at some point. Right now, we're just so thankful and so blessed that she's safe and that we're together again. According to the arrest warrant, the teen's father discovered sexual messages from Snapchat after she disappeared that confirmed a possible relationship between his daughter and Rodriguez. And her mother was told by one of Caitlin's friends that Ryan wanted Caitlin to leave the country with him, and she didn't know how to get out of it and was afraid he would mess up her life. What's the message you want to send out to other parents after going through this week? Because you don't know what tomorrow brings is to hug your babies every day and to tell them how much you love them and make sure that they know um, that they can come to you with anything and that you're, you can work through whatever it is. Rodriguez faces a felony charge in Florida of interfering with child custody and he could face additional federal charges for taking Fresina across state lines. Officials say if there are no local charges filed in New York, they expect Rodriguez to be extradited to Florida this week. As you can imagine, this family has a lot to process. I think the mom said a very good thing when she said, tell your kids no matter what it is, you can talk to us about it. Because my heart ached for her when I saw her on TV pleading with her daughter, please just call us and let, let us know you're all right. That's yeah. the message. They're going to yeah. take this day by day, but they're even going to go to counseling if they have to Good. work through this. So did she go with him willingly? It seems as if she did. They didn't know they had a relationship until after they disappeared. Yeah. Thank goodness a friend came forward yeah, and told. This could have ended a lot worse. Yeah, yeah. we're fortunate for them. Meg, thank you.